Eric Maylander is a wildlife photographer who knows these waters well. On May 9th, the day Ben Kelly died, Eric is flying his drone a few miles away, and he's shocked by what he's seeing. That day I saw 15 sharks. In my years on the ocean, I've never seen so many sharks in one place. It's not just their numbers that rattle Eric. These sharks are so close to shore, it's troubling. Could Eric's observation be indicative of a wider problem? Why are so many sharks so close to the shore? According to Dr. Ebert, the answer might be found in the shark's anatomy. We have a great white shark. This is a baby white shark. This one here is probably four and a half feet long, and it is literally was probably just recently born. All sharks have an amazing ability to help them navigate by feeling their surroundings. It's along in here, it's this lateral line system. The lateral line extends from a shark's snout to its tail and actually lies beneath the skin. It features a series of fluid-filled canals which are lined with microscopic hair cells. When pressure waves reach these hair cells, they vibrate, alerting the predator to movement in the surrounding water. It's the shark version of sonar. They're picking up frequency. And certainly from a, a high-speed predator like this, it helps it for hunting. It helps them determine, is this a predator, is this a prey? 